Oh my god, this is looking so good. Let's go. This thing is beautiful as hell. I also like this one. I like all of them. I love carabits. Oh my god, these are the sharpest edges I've ever seen. Oh no. <laughs> this protrusion is so stupid. Oof. This is something completely different. Oh, this is double edged. Get wrecked. This is gonna be interesting. Oh. Initiating. Welcome back to my daily grind. Create yourself is what you'll find me doing every day and every night. No time to lose. One day, one step in the right direction. I'm Chris and I'm only here to show you if I can do it, you can do it too. Welcome back to the vlog. It is Monday, another day, another chance to push out. And the topic for this vlog are new carom bits for my knife collection. So let's get it. But before we get started, love goes out to all my subscribers. Thank you for making my life special and worth living to the max. So let me try to get back with a sweet, sweet video. Over the last days and weeks, a few more carom bits arrived at my place. And yeah, I want to unbox them so bad. And you know, I need to vlog it. If you missed my knife collection video, check it out right here. Half a million views by now. I think something is crazy. And it is of course consistently getting bigger one day i will do an update on on that <laughs> one day but yeah for now let's just unbox all of that right here so i basically have two somewhat high quality knives still quite cheap and then tons of cheap carambit knives for you know diy projects and fun stuff like that these are the cheapest ones that i that i found I think one of them was like four bucks or something like that. Really freaking cheap. Yeah, and fits like it, definitely. <laughs> if you want to know more about this construction, then check out my analysis, my anal whatever. Very interesting because this consists of two metal inlays basically, and it's, wow, this one is really freaking light, but it should do for another claw build. So I think I bought Five or six. Okay, well, actually, let's just push this and box all of them. Eleven. Twelve. Yeah, okay, six, six. Damn, that's a lot of boxes right here. I got myself six black ones and six fade ones, I think is what you call them. The rainbow thingy. Oh my god, these are the sharpest edges I've ever seen. Oh no. <laughs> oh, this would be terrible for flipping. Oh no. So yeah, let's say there's a lot of current bits right there. But these are the lame ones, of course. Let's get to a little bit of excitement right here, I guess. This box is looking pretty dope, actually. Colorful and wonderful. Like, that's a bit weird. <laughs> But the design, I really like the design, hell yeah. Now this one I think was hmm, like 15 bucks or something like that. The design is way cooler, but I think like all in all, it's probably very same-ish. Oh my God, let's go. Whoa, this is, this is something else. Oh my God. Whoa, this is feeling way better. Check out this ring. It has rounded edges. That is amazing. I still don't get this protrusion right here. It's so stupid, but yeah, this ring is actually a bit chamfered, especially the inside. That is amazing. That is actually pretty dope. Let's go. It has this amazing sound to it. Can you hear this? What the hell is this? This protrusion is so stupid. I can immediately feel it when I flip it. What the hell did I just... Hell yeah, it's a pretty dope carambit right there. Where is the sheet? I lost the sheet. Was it this one? The sheet is probably the same. All of these are the same. But this knife is definitely something else. Pretty cool. Damn, that sheet fits. Okay, and now let's get to the cake. Let's get to the freaking money shot. Rip. Damn, look at this thing. I think this one was like 30 bucks or something like that. So compared to the other ones, fairly expensive. And this construction is a full tank, by the way. You will be able to see that with your own eyes in a, in a few seconds. What am I talking? It comes with a really luxurious looking holster. I don't know, well, if you, whatever you call it. English skills, let's go. Yo, 
This is feeling pretty legit. Damn, son. I think this is called the Strider Karambit. I think if you just Google it, then you will be able to find it under this name. And it looked so amazing on the pictures. Whoa, this thing is heavy. Yo. Oof. This is something completely different. Let's go. Yeah, there it is. Strider says it right here. Oh my god. Oh jeez. Oh no. Oh, this is double-edged. Get wrecked. Oh, this is looking scary. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn, this is great. Yes, let's go. Oh yeah, I remember the ring. That's a perfect ring right here. This is what I like to see. Check this out. This is looking pretty smooth. That is awesome. And that is a thick blade right here. Check this out. Full tang. What's that? Like five millimeters of steel. Damn, son. This is looking pretty sick. This is only on one side though. But other than that, it's symmetrical. Symmetrically, as it looks to me. There are even two little whatever this is. Don't know what it, what the hell is all this, all this stuff. That's interesting though. Oh my god, this feels solid as hell. But the ring is really small actually, so my finger is of course able to fit through. But if you're a bigger dude, like check this out, this ring is pretty small in comparison to, to the other ones. Check out this tiny as hell ring. For me this is pretty perfect, this is like an amazing fit. Damn, it's looking so cool, oh my god. Whoa, it flips amazing, but it transition. Thumb roll is probably hard to do. Vortex is probably really hard to do with this one. But like the snap and stuff like that. Flip extension, let's go, easy money. Sweet. Okay, this thing is genuinely amazing. I mean, just look at it. What the hell are these things though? We're looking screws, man. But other than that, it is an amazing design. Hell yeah. And it's looking pretty simple to me. I think I can do that. I could do that with my CNC. Hey, so check this out. Just cleaned up this mess. Oh, by the way, Velvet BB, if you're interested in this trainer design of mine, check out this vlog. So yeah, that's, that's my... <laughs> Made a nice piece of art right there. Here are all my sheets. That's a lot of sheets right there. And this crazy thing right here. This is so cool. Let's go. This is dope. <laughs> yeah. Get me to one million, goddammit. Let's soak in this beautiful display right here for a second. But the light isn't doing it any justice whatsoever. It's looking pretty boring, actually. Is there any way for me to change that? Oh, wow. No, well, kind of, I guess. For the thumbnail. Still looking a bit boring, though. <laughs> well, whatever. Okay, this one takes the cake. Obviously, it's the most expensive one. It's full tang. It's amazing. It fits perfectly for me, for my tiny hand. Well, I guess I have a fairly tiny hand. This one is pretty dope, except this protrusion right here is so stupid. The ring would be pretty, pretty ideal. This design looks pretty dope as well. And all these generic ones, sharp edges and stuff like that, it's pretty terrible. But you know, you get what you pay for. Cheap knife right there. But well, you know, I'll take it. Definitely. After my Keramid Claws experiment, well, I have, I have more ideas. You know, Keramid Claws, check out this vlog right here if you missed it. But that's basically it. Now, I had this idea to go for five which is so dumb, like literally stupid, but I think I will try. It's just like freaking five. That would be crazy. Okay, and another idea for the near future would be another climbing vlog because Frankie said, you know, I can climb with carambits for sure. So that's another, that's another idea. And yeah, more, more carambit weapon builds, I guess. So this should last for the next vlogs, I guess. But this thing, oh my God, this thing is amazing. Why is it, oh, it comes off easily, perfect. Okay, just for fun, let's also test the sharpness. Whoa, not too bad actually. It's not too bad. Okay, let's take this one. Mm, yeah, that's that's actually that's better. That's even better. Okay, that was to be expected, I think. Fairly clean cuts from this one. These are a bit rough, rough edges right here. This is gonna be interesting. 
Oh. Oh my god, let's go. That's pretty cool. Throw this thick. Oh my god, this one is... I was going to say this one is even better, but... Ah, not re no, this is definitely sharper. Definitely. But these aren't too shabby either. Seriously, this is not too bad. Damn, I did not expect that. Okay, this is a scary caramel. Oh my god, this is generally a scary caramel. A scary one. Damn, I'm gonna have to hang this up on the wall. This is just too good. 12, 14 more caramels. This might actually be a more compelling thumbnail, I guess. This is, yeah, this is looking pretty dope. Damn, more caramels for my knife collection, baby. This is looking pretty dope. <laughs> no, don't freaking tell me. What the hell? Oh God, okay, it's, oh yeah, perfect fit actually. Never mind. I was like, <laughs> it's not going to fit, but it does. Alrighty, new favorite caramel right there. Favorite third party caramel that is. <laughs> but yeah, that's enough progress for today. Smash that like button where I smash my wallet just a bit with the purchase of 14 more caramels. Bang the bell like crap to never miss caramel related vlogs. Check the recent news on chrisviral.com. And yeah, that's it for today. I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>